morning everyone it is really early right now well actually it's not really early it just feels early because the sun's not even come up yet um but it's like seven in the morning right now and i'm heading to a hair salon called austin thompson to get like a hair treatment done which is quite exciting my hair is kind of gross today but i didn't want to wash it just for them to wash it again anyway i am heading there now i'm gonna go get the bus it's like the other side of town so it's gonna take me forever hence why i'm up so early and then i'm gonna do some uni work today basically i'm just gonna do a vlog for you guys i didn't vlog like throughout my week so it's friday right now i'm kind of gonna do like a weekend vlog because it's much more exciting i'm doing a little bit more not a lot more but i'm doing a little bit more that I have been doing Monday to Thursday so I thought I would just do like a weekend vlog this time change it up a bit instead of weekday we're doing weekend so I'm going to grab the bus because I am running I'm not running late but you know I need to leave so I'm currently getting a treatment done on my hair it feels so soft already and smells amazing it's just sitting on for like 10 minutes my hair looks bad and then we'll wash it off and blow dry my hair so we use this one here on my hair and then these are the other the other five options but we use this one here which is for repairing the rest are like keratin and hydration and stuff we use this one here so I'm just in the bus right now I am heading to see my boyfriend we're going to do some revision at the library which is just around the corner from my house But my hair feels amazing. There's also going to be a video on Austin Thompson's YouTube channel, so I will link that down below once it's up. And I'll link his Instagram and stuff so you guys can like check him out. He's amazing. He's going to be dyeing my hair very, very soon. In a couple of weeks, to like a bit more blonder and a bit more like extra. So yeah. Hi everyone. I have not been using my camera, which I'm sorry about. Jason and I went to. Can't do that. I'll get copyright. Jason and I went to Costco, we had lunch, feels like ages ago now. I got pizza and a uh, um, hot dog, but never at the hot dog. I was just really, really hungry and my eyes were too big for my stomach. Then we walked around Costco, I got a few bits and pieces. I got some moisturizer from my mum and then I got some hair oil from Aussie, which was like super cheap. And then we went to the library, we've been at the library, you can't see it done some work didn't take my camera in there either and then we're gonna go and collect an order delivery from the post office because I missed it yesterday got my package Woo! right <clears throat> interesting lighting uh, I picked up my parcel it was this little thing here which will be in another video and also a few Instagram posts, so that will be revealed later on. We are now going out for a meal, Jason and I. I'm wearing this necklace, which is from InStyle, maybe? Or one of those kind of like pretty little thing, or I saw it first, one of those ones. Then my top here is from Fashion Nova, and then I've got these, uh, what are these? <laughs> Full leather leggings, which are also from Fashion Nova actually. I'm all very coordinated. And then my earrings are just like pearls. And then I've got my Daniel Wellington watch on. My hair is not looking in the best shape despite having it done this morning. I think because I was working when I'm studying, I touch it a lot and then it gets greasy quite quickly. So it's a bit of a shame, but I'll probably flick it like to the side in a minute or something. Something like this. Wow, that's crazy. So we're gonna go out for a meal tonight. I don't really know why. We're not really going out for like a particular reason. We've just kind of been working and not doing much socializing. So we thought, why not go out for a nice meal? We're going out for a late meal. So it's half past eight. Our table's booked for, again, don't know why. And we're going to Prezzo, which is like a fancy chain, Italian kind of place. The food looks really good. We've got like a three course meal that we're gonna go for like fully indulge that's the plan so i'll take you along this top is actually a shirt i think i showed it in a recent haul but i've gone for like a bar you know alter it a little bit and this is what it looks like my next clips will probably be me showing you my food most likely just waiting in the car jason forgot his oh my gosh jason forgot his wallet so i'm waiting in the car but look at kira she's like what's going on oh she's off Aww. 
There he is. <laughs> I went for like purpy, purpy, purple smoky eye. It's using the Sophie Dust Nails palette, the first one. Thank you. Guess what I'm gonna put on? I'll give these two points: one for like relative closeness, and then one for bang on. Oh, oh you see the reflection. Uh -huh. Imagine dragons. Oh, my God. Good the, run. Yeah. Okay, you got one out of two. First course, we're gonna share both. So we got bruschetta, which is huge. And then these are like breaded mozzarella, fancy mozzarella today, basically. And we've traded our wine for Coke because we're driving tonight. It's <laughs> been very boring. Second course, I've been basic and got margarita. I was gonna get the same as Jason, but then Jason got it, so I was like, mm, I can always taste his. And then I made a rash decision. I should have really gone for something a bit more extreme, but mm, here we go. Classic margarita. <laughs> if this is not tendencies of a psychopath, I don't know what it is. <laughs> we just want to keep enough room for our dessert. Yeah, so we left all the rest. Yet again, Caitlin has gone for the basic option. I was gonna get this, but I don't have. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that steam. Um, no, I did not have the space in my stomach, so I just got ice cream to kind of like easy. Easy to eat, it goes down well. Is it good? Morning everyone, it is Saturday right now. Jason, myself and Brody have come to the local library and we are doing like two hours of work before Brody goes to work. Jason has an interview and I have a bottle to get ready for. So we're just doing some work. This is like the most unlibrary library we've ever been to because it's so noisy. You can hear the child screaming in the background. So we're just gonna do some work for like a couple hours. Not very long, but like at least it's a little bit so I don't feel guilty that I've done nothing today. Afternoon, it is just before three o'clock on um, Saturday and I'm gonna start getting ready for my ball. It is extremely early and quite ridiculous that I'm getting ready at this time but the reason and the kind of justification which I'm giving from it is the fact that the sun will set and I'm not joking an hour and I want to film a get ready with me because I'm gonna experiment with a different kind of makeup look and I want to do like a winter ball get ready with me because what I'm wearing is very wintry, very kind of like dark and I just want to film it basically. So I have to get ready at this time so that I have a little bit of sunlight. By the time I finish filming it will be, the sun will be set but you know it just makes such a difference having natural light as well as studio light. Like studio light alone is quite ugly and I don't really like it. I'm gonna start getting ready so I'm gonna put this camera on charge, use my big camera to film and I'll upload that video before or after. Link will be down below to the get ready with me if you're interested in watching that. And wish me luck, I'm gonna experiment with a completely new color, completely new kind of vibe. So hopefully it doesn't go awful, but I do have plenty of time to fix it if it does. So yeah, I hope you can see it. Um, so my dress is from Misguided, it's from the tall section. So it's long enough to fit me. It has like a one shoulder kind of vibe. So yeah, one shoulder, I can like move it, but I don't know where I'd want to move it to. So it just kind of sits on there. I guess I could move it a bit higher. I don't know. Anyway, that's, this is what my dress looks like. It's got a slit kind of from the knee, just above the knee, all the way down. I am going to quickly just like fake tan my hands because I've realised how pale they are and also I'm going to do my nails. I've come to my friend's house. She's still getting ready in her room just there. I'm having a small glass of wine to get me started. This little bit of hair, can you see this? It's really pissing me off. It keeps like coming to the front of my face. Yeah, we're gonna head in maybe like 20 minutes to get the buses to the venue because the venue is like super far away in like the countryside, which is exciting, but means we need to get buses, so. Okay, I've arrived. It's amazing. We've got the second one arrival and we're in like the food area right now. Of course I've gone to the food area. I didn't really have much so I'm currently having popcorn. There's also a candy floss stand there. Florence is there. <laughs> and people are staring at me because I'm filming myself. We have found a donut wall. Oh, look at this! <laughs> it's mine now. So it's 
it's a marquee, two marquees outside. They're wandering away from me. And then there's a Kaylee inside, but we're going into the second one. We were just in the food one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Callum, this is the risotto master. <laughs> So hi everyone, I am waiting. I'm doing the most unconventional way of getting home in the world. Jason, my boyfriend, is basically picking me up right now. I'm waiting at the entrance of the driveway. So the driveway is like a good solid half an hour walk away from the venue, but I got a lift from the lovely like bus driver, which was great. Currently waiting on Jason, who is gonna take me home because it wasn't really worth going all the way back to Edinburgh University to then come all the way back to basically where I am right now, which is home. So yeah, I don't know if that made sense but I'm currently doing the most dodgy ass thing in the world and waiting on the darkest road ever you can't you have no idea where I am but I'm basically doing the dodgiest thing ever like the thing they tell you not to do in high school is to wait on a dark lonely empty road without anyone so I'm doing that right now wish me luck I'll vlog it if anything happens and I'm gonna get picked up hopefully fingers crossed morning everyone it is the start of the next week I have Basically just chilled all of Sunday and now I need to go to uni, I've got a lecture this morning and I need to finish this vlog so I can upload it on Tuesday. So thank you so much for watching, I hope it turned out okay. I feel like Saturday's clips were probably a complete mess but hopefully I can order them and it all looks reasonably understandable. Please give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it, subscribe and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye guys!